Hello everyone, this is Naoki Yoshida, producer of Final Fantasy XVI, and welcome to the State of Play. Today, I'm here to talk a little bit about the story, world, and combat system of Final Fantasy XVI, hype, let's go. as well as reveal all new information regarding the game's wide variety of RPG elements and support systems. We'll be talking you through everything while using never-before-seen gameplay footage running on the PlayStation 5. I hope you'll stay with us until the end of the show and enjoy everything we have in store for you. With that, let's get started. Let's go. You all know the target. Shiva's dominant. And only the dominant. Focus, Wyvern. You are key to this mission's success. Yes, Sergeant. Oh, gameplay, let's go. I said focus, Wyvern. All right, here we go. Home, sweet home. Allow me to welcome you to the world of Final Fantasy 16. Final Fantasy 16 is the latest installment in the Final Fantasy series, Yo. a storied franchise with 35 years of history. Yet while this is the 16th mainline title in the series, there's absolutely no need to have played any of the previous games before jumping in. With a fusion of real-time action and RPG features, Final oh, Fantasy play as a kid too. has been developed as the first true action RPG in the series. Using the power of the PlayStation 5 to its fullest, the game delivers an expansive, thrilling gameplay experience which will liken to a high-speed roller coaster ride. Oh my goodness, the combat is so sick. Yo, the music right now. Yo. Is this game of the year? Cuz that was crazy. The protagonist of our story is Clive Rosfield, and his journey takes place in the realm of Valisthea. We follow the epic tale of Clive, shield of the Grand Duchy of Rosaria as it unfolds across three distinct periods in our hero's life, his teens, 20s, and 30s. What? While the story begins with Clive in his 20s, a fully playable flashback will allow you to experience the pivotal events that shaped his past and oh. present. Yeah, that's crazy. And thus does the curtain open on this newest Final Fantasy adventure. Oh my god, I can't wait. Unexpected the menu and everything. 
Navigation in Final Fantasy 16 is driven via a world map, with locations being added and updated as players progress through the main narrative. Nice! The world map can be opened at any time, allowing players access to all manner of locations across Valisthea. Here, players will meet new friends, encounter formidable foes, and uncover great and wondrous mysteries. I love the music so much, man. Wow. That looks beautiful. I can't wait to get lost in this game. Chocobo. Oh man. Yo. Everything is beautiful. Like oh to talk my about god. The of Final Fantasy 16. Please and thank you. All the battles in the game take place in real time and are not turn based. Thank god. Thank As you. As progresses through the story, he will learn a wide array of exciting abilities from the icons that he encounters. Now, let's take a moment Whoa. to admire Clive in action. It's so fast too, I love that. Bro, how many abilities? It's like he has all elements, it's crazy. It's so fast! Like, I can't- I can't get over it. Okay, he is busted. What? what? This man is overpowered. Alright, this is too much. It's too much, like... Stop. How many combinations and powers? Wait a minute, man. The abilities that Clive wields have unique characteristics depending on the icon they are derived from. Oh, that's sick. Use ability points collected by defeating enemies to unlock more abilities or upgrade existing ones. Can't decide which iconic ability to unlock or upgrade? No problem. You can let the game choose for you. Really? Final Fantasy 16 includes a range of timely accessories to provide support to those players who may not be so skilled at action games, bringing them a truly enjoyable experience. Okay. Players are encouraged to equip Clive with different combinations of these accessories until they find the one that perfectly matches their own playstyle. A combination I can particularly I can't wait to test out everything. They struggle with action gameplay is the Ring of Timely Focus Whoa. and the Ring of Timely Strikes. This combination allows players to unleash a wide array of different techniques just by pressing a single attack button, as well as shifting into a window of slow motion whenever Clive is about to be hit by an attack, okay. giving him a little extra time to hit R1 and evade. 
Visually, I just like it. The slow mo. That fully automates evasion. As I said before, I really encourage everyone to discover the combination that works best for them. Okay. I mean, for a more challenging experience, you just do the real time everything. But the slow mo looks so cool. Like, I want to do that too. I don't know. And for those who want to concentrate on the story, don't forget to choose story focus mode before starting a new game. Oh. In this mode, timely accessories are automatically equipped from the start, allowing players to immerse themselves in the narrative experience without having to worry too much with the action. Interesting. I'm going to do action focused. Clive will meet many characters along his journey who will join him as friends and allies. This place. These are fallen ruins. Well, we didn't think they'd mind. And it keeps the black from our lungs. But how do you survive without magic? Sidolphus, who becomes a mentor to Clive. <laughs> Jill. A friend from Clive's youth. It really is Such me. encounters and reunions will set Clive on a path of great personal growth. It is. Clive! Some of these companions will even accompany Clive on his adventures, fighting alongside him and finding lots to talk about along the way. Nice. That said, players will only need to focus on controlling Clive. Party members are fully AI driven, providing support. That's great. I didn't want to have to adapting and control a whole team, action. you know. I don't mind that. Okay. Let's go. Is always by Clive's side and willing to stand by him in the face of whatever cruel fate may befall them. I love that. Torvald will act of his own accord, but players can also give him direct commands. Just don't forget to give this good boy some treats. Hey. Every now and then. Can you pet him? Goots, get her upstairs. But, but none will. Don't fret about Karen. I've taken care of her fee. All of it. She's the best healer this side of the belt. You have nothing to worry about. Go. Have a look around. I'll be in my solo. That voice actor like sounds familiar. The game, Clive will gain access to Sid's hideaway. Here in the hideaway, Clive will find a shop where yes. he can purchase new weapons, armor, and consumables such as potions. All right, cool. That's what I like to see. Blackthorn, a highly skilled blacksmith, works the hideaway's forge, bring in materials to craft new gear or upgrade existing items. After upgrading your equipment or unlocking new abilities, try accessing the Arete Stone. Ooh, training mode. Here, players can enter a virtual training area outside the bounds of time and space where they are free to refine and practice combos of their very own. Let's go. Once you're confident in your skills, try your hand at arcade mode and see how your scores stack arcade up mode? players from around the world. Oh, I'm doing this. The hideaway is home to a lot of other features as well. You know me, I'm a side quester. I'm doing all this stuff. Players discover a variety of side quests here. 
but they can also view information on quests offered all around Valistia. so cool it's a mogul oh, I wasn't expecting you back so soon visit the hunt board to gain information on elite marks Fearsome foes lurking about the realm in desperate need of slaying. The Moogle will be your guide. Alright. Ew. Got a bounty quest. Okay. Harpocrates who will unlock Valisthea's secrets as Clive recounts tales of his adventures. Oh my goodness. I have quite the find for you today. I love it. Yo, what the heck? You wish to study the tomes? Here for another of my lectures. And Vivian Ninetales, what is it a scholar and strategist who will Here's be more than happy to explain to Clive the current state of the realm and provide information on key players. There are all kinds of interactions and features in the hideaway to help players get even more enjoyment out of their time with Final Fantasy 16. Okay. Travis, Clive will encounter a wide array of fearsome foes. So impressed. Yo, that's crazy. Yo. God, he's disrespectful, man. He will, of course, clash with the dominants who wield the power of the icons. These boss fights are gonna be crazy, man. Beasts who hold the surrounding lands under their sway. Whoa. Mysterious constructs of the fallen, a civilization shrouded in mystery. It's crazy. Oh my goodness.
cannot forget the icons themselves. Experience unparalleled real-time action combat as Clive takes command of the iconic might coursing through Real time is an understatement. His very limits. This is so crazy and fast-paced. I love it. The shining point of Final Fantasy 16, however, has to be the breathtaking icon versus icon battles. I can't wait for this. It looks insane. confrontations all play out in real time allowing players to control that is so their very crazy icon with their own hands yo these battles differ depending on the icon encountered and every showdown is unique right <laughs> this would be so epic play. These icon battles, bro. From a 3D scrolling shooter to a heavyweight wrestling match with devastating attacks that encompass the entire battlefield. These massive scale boss battles are entirely seamless, and I can promise you heart stopping, controller gripping excitement. I can't wait for you to get your hands on the game for yourself. Music. Whoa. Nice trick. But if you can do it, then so could I. Yo. This is overwhelming at this point. It's showing so much, like... This is... I can't even talk. Bro, the music too? What is happening? They are going all out with this game. So everyone, what did you think? Thank you for taking the time to join us today. Final Fantasy 16 Damn. will be available that was crazy. June 22nd. And there's still plenty that we've left to reveal. Battle content, side content, more? end game content, and more. We hope to bring you more on these aspects of the game in the near future. Also, I'm truly excited You're gonna show to show more after that? that Final Fantasy 16's main theme was written and performed by one of Japan's greatest recording artists, Kenshi Yonezu.
We've still got a lot more in store for you in the coming weeks, and I hope you'll all pre-order the game and join us in Valisthea on release day. This has been Naoki Yoshida, producer of Final Fantasy XVI. See you again soon. That was amazing. That was so much. And they're going to show more after that? That's insane.